A big thanks to MSI and Corsair for sponsoring our Computex 2018 coverage. Check out Corsair's fancy new Vengeance RGB memory, and don't forget to arm yourself with the game-changing performance that only MSI GeForce GTX 10 series graphics cards can deliver. Give yourself the competitive edge you're looking for even in the most challenging titles. Fast, powerful, and made to game. Visit the link in the description now to learn more. Welcome back to Hardware Unbox. We're here at the ASRock booth to check out some of their latest Intel products. Now, I was expecting to see some Intel Z390 motherboards here at the show, at especially the ASRock booth, but as it turns out, Intel's Z390 platform hasn't been launched at Computex 2018. We haven't seen any Z390 boards at the ASRock booth or really for any other company here at the show. So. Clearly, Intel is still working on the Z390 platform and will be showing it off perhaps later this year. Of course, we have seen some Z390 leaks in the past couple of months, but like I said, they're just not here at the show yet. So again, we'll be waiting to see that later in the year, hopefully, alongside their new 8-core CPUs that have also been rumored. And that's pretty disappointing, to be honest. Aside from the Core i7-8086K that was leaked a couple of days before Computex kicked off, Intel really hasn't shown any new consumer components or platforms that you'll be able to get your hands on in the coming months. We've been hearing about Z390 through various rumors for months and months now. And in fact, it was just a couple of weeks ago that Intel themselves accidentally released documents for the Z390 chipset, detailing every aspect of the platform. We thought this accidental document leak would definitely mean Z390 was coming at Computex, but we're here at the show now and not one company was showing off new Z390 boards. So if you were eagerly awaiting the Z390 platform for its native USB 3.1 Gen 2 support and integrated Wi-Fi 802.11ac support, we're sorry to say that you might be waiting a bit longer. With Intel struggling to get next-gen chips out the door in 10 nanometers, it's looking more and more likely that 8-core Coffee Lake will launch later this year as Intel's ninth generation of desktop processors. Perhaps Z390 will launch alongside it or a bit before those CPUs. It's hard to say for certain at this point, but it was a bit surprising to hit the Computex show floor only to find no Z390 boards anywhere. But we do have some other cool things to check out here from ASRock and Intel, so let's get straight into it. Okay, so we're here with ASRock's latest Z370 Tai Chi platform that they're showing off here at Computex 2018. In fact, it actually has two of their RX 580 Phantom Gaming GPUs in there as well, so it's pretty exciting. But the key feature of this particular system that they're showing off is Intel's Optane memory. Now, if you do have a mainly hard drive driven system, maybe you have a SATA SSD in there as well, Optane memory does have the ability to accelerate your game loading times, which is partially what they're showing here with some of their benchmarks. Now, I actually built an Intel Optane memory system in a live stream on the channel just a couple of weeks ago, and I might be doing a bit of testing on Optane in the coming weeks with that particular system. So it'd be really interesting to see how it actually goes as far as speeding up games and accelerating that sort of thing. So stay tuned for a bit more of that on Hardware Unboxed. All right, we're here with another Intel system at the ASRock booth. In fact, on this side, I'm actually being cooled by one of their mining rigs that's running at the moment. Pretty nice to get some of that cool breeze for the Taiwanese heat. But on this side, we have a Fatality X299 system. And the cool thing about this particular system is that it's running their Ultra Quad M.2 card. So that's a PCIe 16 times expander card. It's got four M.2 cards inside. And running in there are four of Intel's Optane SSD 905Ps. And we'll show you some of their benchmark runs that they've got with that in RAID 0. And let me tell you, there's some extremely impressive performance numbers with that super fast SSD. Of course, we already know Intel's Optane SSDs are really, really fast. And it's cool to see that as a demonstration here at the ASRock booth. All right, so that's it for this video video from the ASRock booth as we were leaving both Steve and I were given these phantom gaming bags uh, with some cool goodies inside actually let's take a look and see what ASRock has been given us so we have here something in a package looks like a custom ASRock hat here so do I look cool Steve Very cool. all good yep all right and there's there's one other item in here we've got an uh, phantom gaming something I bet this is a mouse pad, what do you reckon? Definitely a mousepad. Yep, yeah, definitely a mouse pad, Steve says. Quite a nice looking mouse pad there. So that's all the cool goodies that we were given at the ASRock booth. Hope you like this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe and check out the rest of our Computex 2018 coverage. I'll catch you next time.